loves, welcome to TT's Urban Pantry. I need to make some lotion bars. Here is one of my lotion bars that I currently have, but I'm traveling and I want to put this in a tin and, sorry, Chewy keeps hitting the tripod. But this is a little too big for the tin. Now I can squeeze it in there if I wanted to, but I don't want to. So I want to make up some more lo lotion bars and put some into a tin. At least have one or two for me. So this recipe is extremely easy. I am going to use three ounces each of chamomile oil, beeswax, and cocoa butter. Usually I would use butter but I'm completely out. So here's my beeswax. So I have my three ounces. Pour it in there. And get that started Perfect three ounces of cocoa butter. So I made my chamomile oil with just some chamomile and sweet almond oil. I did like a quick infusion, which I put it on the stove, brought it up to temperature, I let it simmer for an hour took it back down, did that again, and then I just set it on the counter and covered it up. Here are everything, chamomile oil, beeswax, and cocoa butter. That cocoa butter is gonna take a while to break down, which is why I prefer shea butter a little bit more, but we make do with what we have, right? So this is all, all of this needs to come to a liquid is that oil and I let it cool down a little bit just because I want to put some fragrance oil in here and you don't want it to be too hot or to burn all your fragrance off so I'm just gonna put a little bit and this is baby powder scented I love it stir it in and now I'm gonna pour it into I'm gonna start with my tins And I think I want one of these. And then I'll just see where it leaves us. I just got a little bit left. Let's do this. Nice. Okay, so then this just needs to cool down, but we're done. Okay, so this smaller one is done. This one I can already feel is still warm on the bottom a little bit, but here's that. Look at that. 